welcome to expert guidance and thank you so much for showing the interest in my 15 weeks work plan now here i come up with a 15 weeks work plan which is targeted to help you to get that grade in your gcse's now this plan is just not for gcse's all the year eight onwards kids can benefit from this because the topics would be more or less the same there will be just a change in the in-depth content that you need to know now this is not a study plan it's a revision plan so it is useful near to the end of the exam as it is a crash revision plan or it can also be useful at the start of the year to give you the head start and all year eight onwards students can use this for maths and science now in this video i'll be taking you over how this plan will work how you need to form this plan how you need to plan your days according to this plan and how you will be preparing according to this work plan so this is how look at here there we go so the downloadable it is also available in the pdf form on my website the link is mentioned in the description box below so i have divided your physics chemistry biology and maths into week 15 this is from week 1 to week 8 and this is from week 9 to week 13 so we plan to finish up your syllabus in 13 weeks and week 14th and week 15 is just for past paper practice and to do mocks now during this week what we will be covering is all the bigger chapters i have divided them that you'll be covering in two weeks like energy is a bigger chapter so we have spent two weeks in that organic chemistry is a bigger chapter so you'll be uh, having two weeks for that so how essentially you have to follow this plan is you have to do this during the weekdays so it's physics chemistry biology and math so we'll be just doing two days each subject so two days for physics two days for chemistry two days for biology but maths you have to do every day or every alternate days because maths requires a lot of practice so for example if you're doing week one then week one you have to do energy topic atomic structure topic for biology you have to do cell biology and for maths you have to do whole number Numbers, negative numbers mean median mode and range okay so during the week you will be doing these topics and you will be sparing your weekends just for the revisions so during the weekends that is half of the Saturdays and Sundays you will be revising what you have been doing the whole week the second thing that you need to do is since we are dedicating two days for each of the subject you should have a plan for these two days as well so essentially the day one of each subject should be going over the YouTube videos or going over your textbook or going over the notes or prepare the flashcards or mind map, whatever way it works best for you. And on the second day, it is very, very important to do questions by topic. So for example, if you're doing the chapter of atomic structure, then on day two of the chemistry, you should do questions by topic on that particular unit so that you come to know what kind of a questions will be asked in the exam and how you need to answer the questions according to the mark scheme because most of the time you understand the topic but you fail to write according to the mark scheme so the plan works 15 weeks each week two days for each subject and weekends for revision and how you need to do the weekdays two days for each subject maths every day day one go over the content day two do question by topic on the weekends it's a revision day go over the notes flashcards mind map whatever material you made during the week and you go over your question by topics mistake in the weekend so that you can see that if you remember what mistakes you have done and one thing more you need to remember as you move on to week two then at the, on that week two weekend, you have to revise week one as well as week two topics. On week three weekends, you have to revise all week one, week two and week three. So we gradually build upon that. Okay. Now, I know this is a very strigid plan because definitely a, a squeezing the whole year in 15 weeks is definitely a difficult task. But I've tried my level best to make it as feasible as possible. 
but everybody has their own schedule so you can play around with them if you think that you're not able to do cell biology in week one and week two you can swap them over with the week three topics and then you can do them in the next week now detailing about every day is not possible because everybody has their own plan but if you still want me to make a targeted plan as for your needs then you can go onto my website you can sign up for a free 30 minutes consultation and there we can discuss with you and make a targeted work plan if you want now this is the work plan I hope you will like it if you have any feedback on them then do let me know now the next question is how to start I have given you the topics where will you find the content now you have your textbooks you have the YouTube videos but there are a lot of content and it's very difficult to pick which is the best one to choose so what you can do is you can sign up for my drip GCSE course so what's this drip GCSE course is it's a free course you can sign up there with your name email and year of study as you will join that every Monday we will be sending you the whole week's topic content according to this plan so if you sign up for this today then on Monday you will get the notes the question by topics and YouTube videos on all the week on topics and then we'll be releasing it every week so you can follow that trip course throughout and in that drip course I'll be sending you the question by topic the YouTube videos everything you need for preparation for that week and it's all free and even while studying or going over the drip course you have any problem you can come to my website there's a 24 7 chat support there you can put all your queries and get instant replies and also I'm planning to run a live calls either on Instagram or on Facebook where you people can come in and ask all your queries that you faced over a week okay so I hope you'll find this plan useful do let me know in the comment section uh, how you find it if there's any revision you want me to make to that just let me know I'll do that for you and do not forget to subscribe to my channel there you can get all your content resources there there are free YouTube videos that you can watch which are segregated topic wise and you can join my free Facebook group where you can post all your queries and get instant replies from me or your fellow peers or you can follow me on Instagram and there at expert guidance or you can follow me at the hashtag Mahima Maroya and on Instagram and on TikTok I share teasers every day so that's it for me hope you'll find it useful do let me know in the comment section how you find this work plan and what do you want me to make next for you so I'll see you in the revision trip course till then happy revising